Okay, so what I got here is the first of what could be as many as I want. Well, to an extent anyway. Uh, deep cycles. Now this one cost me $15 to experiment with. But, as I've learned, if it doesn't work out, I can get my 15 bucks back. Ironically. Anyway. So it's a, it's a Trojan uh, T1275, 12 volt. And I think they're about 125 or maybe even 150 amp hour to it. Now this is exactly how I got it. All I did was check the electrolyte level. And there is some some swelling in the side. Not a ton. Just a, a light bulge. Uh, check the electrolyte level. It's up. I have not checked a specific gravity, which I probably should have. Um, when I check the voltage on the battery, that's what it sits at. Now keep in mind the guy I got these from will have attempted to charge them, check the electrolyte value, do a load test, and deemed it no good for resale. Okay, so he, he doesn't even get into current pulsing or nothing. He, he does no desulfating. Which is kind of good, in a sense. Um, so, when we check the voltage, it's 12.32, so what I thought I'd do with this one was I would just put a 50 watt load on it. So here we have 12 volt halogen rated at 50 watts. Now, hopefully this meter won't go off the map, but I don't think it should. It should be in the high fours if it, everything was normal. Well, I'm not too sure about that to be honest, but we'll, we're going to find out. So, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to load this thing up, and we're going to have a look at what it does, just the way it is. Okay, so right away, we have 4.5 amps, and let's see what's happening with the voltage. got a good bright bulb. So my intentions are to... I'm still a little bit uh, out to lunch on this. Uh, but for this first round I think I'm gonna take it to uh, 11 and a half. I mean I suppose I could take it to 10 and a half the first time. But I'm not sure if there's a point in that. I'd like to talk to 49er about that. So, just documenting the first steps of this, and uh, if I arguably make use bad technique, then it'll be documented for everybody to to have a look at that, and everybody, including myself, learn from it. So we can see that it's not found its plateau yet, but. From what I understand, I can basically assume that there is not a dead short across one of the cells, which is probably a good sign. Alright, thanks for watching. I'll get back to you. I'll let this run till it hits 11.5 and do our first round of charging. Thanks for watching.